You know, besides the whole fart box thing, Mr. Saturns are actually kind of cute. I want one as a pet. Oh, Bony, don't look at me that way. Just think about it, when Flint gets up in the morning and he sees one of these present boxes sitting on his bed, he'll open it up and the next sound we'll hear is a loud farting sound and then him going, Aw, oh, Mr. Saturn, what? That would make my day. That's what he gets for leaving me at home to go talk to Hinawa and I couldn't come. Welcome back to Mother 3! The Mr. Saturns are currently getting tortured and kidnapped. It seems what they like to do is get tortured and kidnapped. Or put into slavery. Those three things. It's like a hobby to them or something. Well, we ran out of things to do in the valley while the pig masks are here, so we gotta chase them out now. And it's the last house right here. That's a weird looking Mr. Saturn on a totem pole. And that was a weird sound. What was that? Uh, it's either scary stories or making awful sounds. Don't mix them together. It just, it just ruins the whole thing. Just like we just caught them in the middle of an interrogation practice. The Pig Mask Majors! They're the Pig Mask Captains that managed to pepper spray Kumatora at least once. Stop lying! You're lying about not knowing things. Start knowing things immediately. Um, they don't have underarms. How, how does that work? And that Mr. Saturn is a little submissive. Yes, Mr. Pigmask Major, I've been a bad Mr. Saturn. Oh, hi! Yeah, I'm, I'm right here. I, I, I decided not to do anything, so it's, I'm just gonna watch you. Commence what you're doing in a Mr. Saturn's. Are we gonna fight? Alright, we're fighting now. Alright, okay, great. Good. It's the Pigmask Major! And a fright bot. Yeah, he's still lame as ever. The Big Mask Major is actually kind of dangerous, so explode them with your most powerful powers. In this case, it's Fire and Lamalana. But these guys know the answer to trivia card number one, so I'm going to use that on one of these guys. Most dangerous attack right there, the Time Bomb. It waits a few turns, then explodes and does a lot of damage. That doesn't do as much. Pigmas Major says this game stinks! Survey says... That's the number one answer, but what was the question? It's up to you guys to figure it out. Do some homework. Find out what this game stinks means. I'm imposing this on you, viewers! And now we get to explode them since they got the question right. These guys aren't gonna run away. They ain't, as, they ain't scared of trivia. But they will be. When they get set on fire in Lamalana, then they will be very scared. These guys, as you can see, they're quite tough. Make sure you have some AoE before you get in here. Which means area of effect if you never played World of Warcraft or something. See that? They're already dying! This battle would have been dangerous if I wasn't doing what I was doing. Alright, you Frightbot, no one cares. Yeah, I, I'm laughing, but it's not at the story. It's you're a useless robot. You, you understand this in life, right? You died to Kumatora bashing you. You're a useless robot, Frightbot. You can go away. Maybe learn some better stories that people actually enjoy. Like the story of how Kumatora got more levels. I broke your Frightbot. What now, buddies? Um, actually, weren't you supposed to vanish? Is that a perk of being a major, is you guys can't vanish when you die? Is there Facade? Wait a second, it... Facade's dead! He fell off Thunder Tower! Get back here! Why did you die? It, uh, uh, facade, what the heck is that all about? Oh right, that weird looking Mr. Saturn is actually Duster. I can't believe I forgot about this. Speaking of forget, what does Duster think he is now, Mr. Satter? He probably says, Thank you for helping me, boy! That's that's what I think the Saturns sound like. Oh, he has his memory! Wow, that's a first for Duster. He got separated from us and he actually remembers things. But does he have the egg? That's the, that's the million dollar question here. Yeah, those other guys! Oh... 
were they called? Uh, there was something with pigs. I know it. Uh, I swore I'd kick some in the face before. Uh, that her name escapes me at the moment, but the, the egg is safe, at least. No, this is Duster. Kumatora, what the heck? He thought he was lucky. He's not lucky anymore. But the moral of this game is we're all lucky inside. There's a little lucky in all of us. Oh, right, Mr. Saturn's still kidnapped. Uh, we should let them down. They're hanging by a hair, and quite literally. All right, the Mr. Saturns are free! And Duster got filled in on all the details while we were bringing the Mr. Saturns down. Yeah, it sounds like you should come with us, too. We need someone that could use a blinding ability without using PP. Or we could just tie you up and drag you along like Ionia. It's your choice. Duster joined our party! Voluntarily. Alright, the team is assembled again, but Duster's stats kinda stink. Yeah. He's like, <laughs> he's almost 20 levels behind our main characters, Lucas and Boney. It's ridiculous. Alright, Mr. Saturns, you're free. What are you gonna do now? This guy's gonna have some barley tea. That's great. Yeah, I looked into the past on my psychic powers, and you guys had some problems with a barf creature. How do you feel about that? How do you feel like being this game's scapegoat? Or, you know, your lackey. A person that does not have much fortune in life. Yeah, they did mention something about that. But they said they didn't know. We don't need to ask them this. These are honest Mr. Saturns. No, they're not. They're dishonest Mr. Saturns, and I don't like them. Alright, we got it. Okay. I know that you know that I know you know. Do you know? Kumator is a little slow today. She was taking her blonde pills. I apologize for this. Yeah, you think that red hair is natural? No. She's as blonde as Lucas is. And he met Moto to the Magypsies, too. Which one did you meet? No, we're gonna find out when we go that way. Uh, wh which way is that way? Thank you, Duster. Thank you for being so very helpful. They're, uh, they're looking... None of them are looking north. This guy is looking east, one's looking south, the other one's looking north, southwest, and the other one's looking completely west. There's nobody that's looking north! But we're gonna have to go to the volcano, nonetheless. Oh well. Oh good, we get a map to the volcano. Hopefully. A Saturn Valley map! I'm sure this is helpful. I mean, the Mr. Saturn drew it. Two things Mr. Saturns cannot do well, not make fart boxes and make helpful maps. This is completely un unhelpful. What the heck is that? Did you draw it with your nose? This is like the complete polar opposite of what the mole crickets did. They did too much. You did not enough. You should feel bad, Mr. Saturn. You should feel very bad about your lot in life. And there's another familiar face right here. Remember this guy? He failed on us. I haven't forgotten what you did on the airship. You were talking to a steward? And then you just decided to drop us. Oh, what was this guy's name again? Uh, Twine Lizard, Cable Frog, uh, String Parakeet, uh, oh, Rope Snake. Alright, there we go. Hi, Rope Snake. It's been a while. Uh, you should be. You really should. You failed us when we needed you the most. Did you know that? You almost killed us! You almost killed Mother 3! You should be depressed! Someone's in denial. I think I've struck a nerve. Oh. Well, what are you gonna do in the meantime? Exercise your jaw muscles, I hope? I think you should really exercise your jaw muscles. This is, uh, this is a strong suggestion. Are you listening to me? Hey. Hey. Hey! Hey! Exercise your jaw muscles! Seriously, this is terrible. 
Alright, the pig masks are gone and have been replaced by something weirder. Mr. Saturn's! Ah, they're all good friends. Yes, everyone. Including us. Speaking of which, I need to wall up this guy for making a bad map. Oh, uh... Is, is that how that word works? Okay. Alright, I'll see you later, Mr. Turnsat. Alright. What do you feel about Mr. Turnsat? Is his grammar the not good? He has nothing to say about the situation. This guy just has to say now then. Now then! What are we gonna do down then? Explain now then! You started this conversation. You end it. Sure. Stop making fart boxes and I promise I will show up more often. That is a promise and I'll stick to it. Looks like the Mr. Saturn's other hobby is chasing birds around. I like these guys. I've been flip-flopping back and forth from liking these guys and not liking these guys, but I think this will fit the bill right here. That area is actually a shop now, and I need some money. Frog, give me all of my money. Yeah, this is what happens when, uh... When you spend all your time destroying black beanlings instead of fighting normal enemies to drop money, you don't have any money. Don't do what I'm doing. I like power, but I'm also broke. Hopefully I have enough money to uh, buy what I need. I'm also going to have to make some room, too. These rubber capes, I don't think they're going to be very much useful anymore. Thunder Tower is dead, and I have a, I have a strong suspicion that we're not going to run into any more thunder powers or anything like that. Yeah, sell that. That's just gonna get newer equipment right now. Anyway! Yeah. This is not gonna bite me in the rear end at all, but I'm doing. Selling all of my anti-lightning stuff. I'm serious. We got a funny stick and also some civogs for Kumatora. Get it? They're, they're reversible gloves. They're reversible gloves, and they're called Sevolg. You get it? You get it? I'm not gonna explain that joke anymore. Barefoot shoes are not as good as the mystical boots that we got in Chapter 5. So heck with it. Duster doesn't have any defensive items, though, so... We're going into lava. Might as well buy a flame pendant. Why the heck not? Nothing for Bony here, though. So we're just gonna have to pack some other items, like the Boing Ribbon prevents forgetfulness, and we don't want Kumatora forgetting that she has psychic powers, so that'll be bad for us. A rail bandana, which uh, my only guess is some kind of bird. i never seen a rail before. Someone find me a rail. I want to I wanna see what a rail looks like. And of course, Leo pendants. We're slowly creeping up the zodiac here. Yep, they, they fit on your wrist, and they give you defense. I don't know how. And also, there's a honey shower and an attack attractor, which shoots farts. Because somebody stinks, and then they try to kill them. Alright, I'm gonna deposit our money and try to find a way up into a volcano. It's where we have to do now. I bet the, I bet the Mr. Saturns aren't gonna help us out on that either. Oh well. I could do it on my own. There's just way too much th stuff going on in the screen. Sometimes my emulator likes to freak out. This guy has something to say at us. Yes, we heard you the last time. You were full great. Thank you, Mr. Turnsat. Oh. Alright, he corrected himself. By the way, do you know how to get back to Fire Mountain? We really need to go there. No. Alright, fine. We'll figure out our own way. See you later. Bye. He wasn't helpful in the least. These Mr. Saturns are a font of information. It's just information you don't want. Like that! See? They're like... They're like... Crazy wise men! Zoom zoom! We gotta get there quickly. It's like a Hyundai commercial. Up to five people for what? What are you guys doing? Why are you pretending to be a ladder? Oh! Only five can ladder! I get that joke now! Oh, that, that, that bottom guy should be having all the weight. Oh, we could climb these Mr. Saturns. Okay, okay. And this guy has the best view and the least work. He only has to worry about concussions. That's great. That was the Mr. Saturn ladder team. 
They're going for the championship this year. You want to run that by me again? I guess there's girls here. Can't have the population continue without any girls. Not like I can tell the difference. All right, Lucas, you just sit in the bathwater and think about what just happened here today. Yeah, lots of craziness. Pig masks, they ran away now. And now we have a fire mountain to contend with. And we also have to find a way to level up Duster. That's just ridiculous. Exhaust? You mean your farts, right? Wash the farts off. What is this Dakota everybody keeps speaking of? I don't want a Dakota. Stop giving me Dakotas. And here's Item Hobo. He found his cart. Remember on the mountain? He, he, he didn't have it. Speaking of not having things, I actually forgot an enemy and an item. The enemy I forgot is living on top of the mountain that we just came from with uh, Lydia. Yeah, he's kind of hard to spot. He looks like a little snowball. He's called the Frozen Bun. Also, I forgot the trivia card number two at Thunder Tower. Yeah, that thing got exploded now. We can't go back and get it. But the answer was Croquette Roll. So you can figure out the question from there. Well, he almost had a tune going there, but ah! <laughs> oh, what did he have, though? It sounded a little wet at the end. I, I liked it better when there was fireworks and music in those boxes. Not farts. I want my firework music back. Can you guys invent fireworks and music, please? Hey, that actually looks like a wall staple spot up there. And we have a guy that can wall staple. But he can't reach. Mr. Saturn, I know you've been incredibly unhelpful so far, but uh, we need to get up there. What's your idea? We're out of we're out of ideas. I guess they're gonna build a ladder. Wait a second, is this the ladder team from before? It's time for the Saturn Valley Ladder Championships, everybody. Let's see the pros at work. That ladder looks a little unstable. We're gonna have to send someone useless to go up there and not get a concussion. I wonder who that will be, though. We need a few more people, though. Um, yeah, can you queue ladder a little higher? Oh, only five can ladder, after all. Well, Duster, you're up. You can wall staple, and you're expendable. He's gonna climb the Mr. Saturns and have some barley tea while he's at it. Wow. It, it, this is a really bad idea. I hope you don't fall. Well, actually, I do. Fall! Fall! Fall over! Ah. Looks like six can ladder. And also, you're changing that shirt before you rejoin our team, by the way. Yeah. And Mr. Saturn had a cold. Alright, wall staples. Ah, he sneezed on me too. Ah. Keep your bodily functions to yourselves, Mr. Saturns, please? Alright, it's time for the dismount! Perfect form! I give them a 10 out of 10. But they sneezed and farted on me, so they only get a 5. Sorry, Mr. Saturns, better luck next year. Alright, we can't go back that way, quite obviously. They don't want to make another ladder. So we're just gonna head on. Yeah, it's looking more fire mountainy by the moment. And here's another mole cricket. I told you they'd be setting up shop. And they've been branching out! They have a franchise now! Welcome to Mick Mole Cricket! Can uh can he take your order? And even even been working on their PR too. Yeah, they don't have it quite down pat yet. But they have some nice items they had laying around. I mean made. Like sincerity dumplings and anti-status effect stuff that we'll never need. Yeah, I don't have any money for all this stuff anyway. I'm trying to save it. I'm a, a little bit of a miser. Time to meet the mi next Majipsy. Sleepy! That's one of the Majipsies, right? Usually they end with Ia. Sleepia! There we go. Sounds like a Final Fantasy spell. It's actually Phrygia, or Phrygia. I'm gonna say Phrygia. I nod. 
She's the sleep talking Majipsy, also known as the slocking Majipsy. Alright. Oh, that Majipsy's no help at all. Kinda like that Mr. Saturn map. Yeah! We're we're there. We are right there. That's great. Thanks. Ah, uh, do you have a needle laying around here somewhere? Got any barley tea? I'm craving barley tea all of a sudden. Maybe you should stop drinking the chamomile. Maybe you'll be awake to give us plot. Uh, instead, she left a letter. That's actually kind of thoughtful. It's Phrygia! Oh, well, she thought ahead. I like this Majipsy. She speaks my language. But I don't put hearts as periods on my sentences, though. Ionia told me you were coming here, then I wrote on her. By the way, take Ionia off this board and make sure she gets to where she needs to go next. Great! A lake of lava! Just what I wanted today, thanks, Frigia. The time will come, and you will disappear in your sleep and not dream anymore. Because you will be unmade! But there's a boulder blocking the way. I'm gonna have to give it some encouraging words! You've got any of those laying around? I'm kinda out. I had a rough day. Please don't kiss me on paper. Thank you. Encouraging words! And also there's a... There's a message written on the back of this piece of paper. Help me, Phrygia has taken me captive and wrote on me in permanent marker. Signed, Ionia. Oh, wow. Sucks for Ionia. Ah, uh, I'm, I'm sure... I'm sure he's fine. It'll get back to where it needs to go. When we have to pull its needle, whenever that is. Alright, that's the boulder we're talking about, and... Here's our encouraging words in a bottle. Because uh, that's what you do, you store them in bottles. I have a whole closet full of these. I break them out on a rare occasion. Alright, I'm gonna tell this boulder something it really wants to hear. You are 5% Dolomite. That means you're 5% more awesome than every other rock. Show how awesome you are! And for its next trick, I'm gonna make this rock talk. Ah, he feels much better. See you later, rock. You have fun doing what you're doing, being a, a rock guy. Do I have to say encouraging words to these rocks, too? The vial's kinda empty. Horizontal boulder. But, okay, that, that works. It, if all these are horizontal boulders, we're stuck. A Verta Boulder! Alright, this is just getting silly. Alright. It's a very simple puzzle, if you can tell by now. It's one of those Legend of Zelda puzzles. But, uh, a little wackier. Mother 3, what? Now you're turning on the silly? It's a little late. I'm killing, I'm killing everybody and taking their needles and stuff. Next time on Mother 3, we're gonna have lots and lots of lava. You see that lava over there? How about this lava over here? That lava down there! We're gonna get set on lava in the next video, and I'm not gonna enjoy it! I'm Armored Chocobo. Good night.